Eddie the Teddy, Dreaming with the Moon The moon shines brightly. Eddie is getting ready to go to bed. Eddie is in bed and snuggled under the blanket. Eddie closes his eyes. Tick tock, tick tock. How much time has passed? It's already dark outside, but Eddie can't seem to fall asleep. Eddie closes his eyes again and tries to fall asleep. Did Eddie fall asleep? Eddie is still not asleep. He looks at the bright moon outside the window. Suddenly, Eddie is curious. Why is the moon always alone? Eddie wants to ask the moon, but the moon is too far away. Eddie gets out of bed and goes to the window. Eddie thinks about how he can become friends with the lonely moon. Eddie wonders, is there any way to get closer to the moon? If I go up to the highest place, could I meet the moon? Eddie decides to ask his friends about where the highest place in the village is. Eddie leaves his home in a hurry. Eddie looks for his friends that don't sleep at night. Eddie finds Mr. Owl up in the tree. Eddie asks, Mr. Owl, Mr. Owl, where is the highest place in the village? The hill with the apple tree is the highest place, replies Mr. Owl. Then, Eddie sees his friend Bat flying in the distance. Eddie calls out to Bat and asks, Do you know where the highest place in our village is? The mountain behind the hill is the highest place in the village, replies Bat. Who else can Eddie ask? Just then, a wolf walks up towards Eddie. Eddie decides to ask the wolf too. Hello, do you know where the highest place in the village is? The carousel in the amusement park at the center of the village is the highest place, replies the wolf. Where will Eddie go? Where do you think Eddie should go? In the end, Eddie chooses to go up onto the roof of his house. Eddie sits on the roof and looks up at the sky. The moon looks like it is close, but why is it so far away? Eddie is worried that the moon will not have any friends and be lonely at night. So, Eddie decides to ask the moon. Will the moon reply? Hello, moon. Don't you feel lonely up in the sky all alone? Hi, Eddie. At nighttime, I can see everyone, and they can all see me. So I am never alone, replies the moon. But we can't play together, and we can't eat cake together, since you are always far away, says Eddie. Eddie wants to send friends to play with the moon, but the moon is too far away. Eddie suddenly has an idea. He rushes into his room to get something. Balloons! If Eddie can't go up, he will blow up balloons 
to send them into the sky to be with the moon. Eddie starts to blow up the balloons one by one. Now it looks like there is a party up in the sky. The moon comes closer with a big smile and says, "Thank you, Eddie. Tonight will be a happy night." Eddie, I want to give you something too. The moon shows Eddie a rainbow of twinkling stars. Eddie looks around and starts to count: one star, two stars, three stars, four stars, five stars, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, ten, eleven, twelve. Was this all a dream? Eddie had already fallen asleep. Eddie must have met the moon in his dream. Well, good night, Eddie. Good night, everyone. The end.